I was reading I, I was reading an article um, about a woman who said that you have all these dreams for you, as soon as you decide that you want to have children. You know, I've wanted children ever since I was a little girl. And in your head, you have all these dreams and fantasies about who you want them to be and what you want their life to be like. And then when it turns out to be something like this, which is something you never imagined, you there is a grieving process you have to go through. You do have to grieve that things aren't what... <laughs> you have to grieve that things aren't the way you thought they would be. Ah! They really don't want to communicate with the outside world. They're perfectly happy in their own being and doing what they're doing. I want people to understand that even though children with autism and adults with autism maybe need extra care or special care, they shouldn't be treated any differently than you and I. And that's what we're doing right now. We're just doing absolutely everything within our power to give them all the help that we can possibly give them and all we can do is just hope that him not having support he needs because he so much relies on other people to give him love and give him attention because he needs that so much yeah but i i know he's in i know he's behind those blue eyes yes i know he is